Hello, uh, I'm Gustavo and I'm here to briefly present Banting Dao entry for the common surprise. So Banting Dao is a DAO that can help us achieve uh, the following objectives. The first one is to help uh, regulate or liberate intellectual property and pricing of treatments and solutions for diabetes. Uh, the second objective is to coordinate to help people in urgent need of medication. Uh, to understand these objectives, I think I need to briefly explain what diabetes is. And to do so, I will define first insulin. Uh, so insulin is a hormone that regulates the blood sugar in our bodies. And diabetes uh, is a chronic disease that occurs uh, either when the pancreas does not produce enough insulin or when the body cannot effectively use the insulin uh, it produces. The key word here is obviously insulin. And according to the World Health Organization uh, data from 2014, diabetes affected more than 422 million people around the world. And a small percentage of people with diabetes have a variation of diabetes that is called type 1 or insulin-dependent uh, diabetes. And in this type of diabetes, our bodies do not produce any insulin at all. And we require external daily administration and a very complex management of insulin and food. Uh, to prevent us from basically dying. Uh, so the most advanced treatments include insulin pumps and continuous glu glucose monitors that help us make better decisions about insulin usage, but uh, their cost is very high and they're not accessible to, to everyone. Insulin was discovered in 1922 by Dr. Frederick Banting. And uh, before that, after being diagnosed, uh, people with type 1 diabetes will last alive for weeks before dying. So the discovery of insulin has been one of the greatest gifts that we as people with diabetes have been given. It has allowed us to live more normal lives. So when Dr. Banting, who received the Nobel Prize in 1923, discovered insulin, he and his team decided to sell the patent for $1. After these, uh, they partnered with an insulin manufacturer that allowed the hormone to be produced and distributed all around the world, saving many lives. Uh, throughout time, uh, insulin prices have increased by a lot without much control. Uh, they have increased, although R&D expenditures that you can see on the graph in uh, blue and uh, production costs that you can see in green have not increased by that much. So this is sort of like an indication of price gouging by pharmaceutical companies. Uh, so this has caused a lot of problems and a very harsh reality for many. Uh, one of those realities is that around one in two people around the world who need insulin cannot properly access it. And many die while trying to ration it. So going back to our objectives, um, there are many things that we in the community have done uh, that have worked really well. And these initiatives have to do with circumventing regulations and intellectual property. Uh, the we are not waiting hashtag, which you can search on Twitter, basically gives you an incredible uh, story of people with diabetes and their relatives using open source software and hardware to advance the quality of life of people with diabetes, all for free on their free time. I was involved in the movement and have been greatly benefited from it. Uh, these are pictures from the devices that I began creating uh, thanks to the help of this incredible community and the tools that they were creating. This is actually uh, uh, data from how my blood glucose control regularly behaves, which is very, very good uh, for a person with diabetes. And um, basically open source software uh, has been very important in this effort because uh, mainly because it respects the user freedom and uh, respects the community. Uh, I've also worked on another project which is a simulator uh, called Glucosim uh, for people with diabetes that uh, helps health professionals and researchers understand and experiment freely with technology so that there is a lower cost barrier to innovation within the diabetes field. Uh, that and other projects could benefit from Banting Dao by a lot uh, by helping create tools to foster and promote more projects uh, like these. Uh, so now for the coordination part, uh, I think that while we set up structures to organize and create an economy around uh, these public good goods, I think we can also begin helping people uh, that require urgent access to insulin and so save lives while working in ways to change the current state of things around diabetes. Uh, this slide basically shows uh, just an example of the incredible work people do on social media coordinating access to medication 
for people in urgent need of it. Um, and finally, uh, the reason why we decided to give this DAO the name Banting is obviously in honor of Dr. Frederick Banting. Uh, after him and his team uh, discovered insulin and sold the patent for $1, uh, there's a quote from him that goes, insulin does not belong to me, it belongs to the world. Uh, it will be a great, great honor to be able to create a DAO uh, that shares the same, the same values exactly 100 years after the discovery of this life-saving medication. So we really, really hope uh, that we can make this a reality. Uh, thank you.